Take the youth unemployment, for example. It's a huge problem, youth unemployment. All over Europe, you hear the youth unemployment. I said, why should it happen? Why can't we create a social business to employ these young people one way? Another thing I keep talking about, and I'm practicing it in Bangladesh, uh, in encouraging unemployed young people, I said, the whole idea of employment is the wrong idea. Forget about employment. That's, a, that's something you've got somewhere else. You, it, it doesn't belong to you. It doesn't belong to any human being. Human beings are not born to serve under somebody. So we created a social business fund, encourage unemployed young people, come up with business ideas. We become your investors. You decide what kind of entrepreneur you want to be. So why do you want to be decided by somebody else? Your fate is not decided by somebody else. Your fate is decided by yourself. We started microcredit in Bangladesh. And everybody said, oh, it's a poor country needs it. Now we have seven branches right here in New York City with nearly 25,000 borrowers. We started six years back. So 25,000 borrowers, all women. Average loan is $1,500 in New York City. And repayment rate is near 100%. It's 99.4% repayment rate. No collateral, nothing. Exactly the way we do it in Bangladesh. This is not your business. It's our joint business. We are co-investors. You invest yourself and we invest our money. So it's our business. So it's, don't say, if my business fails. You should say, if our business fails. Because we are party to it. It's not a loan. Loan is your responsibility. I gave you a loan, you have to pay me back whether your business succeeds or not. Not in a liquidity situation. It's our business. Together we work very hard to make sure that that business uh, succeeds. Again, unemployment is a very unnatural thing. Human being has nothing wrong. Why should they be unemployed? Why should they? Unemployment is a paralyzed person. It's an kind of invisible chain kind of uh, stopping me. Otherwise, I'm a very energetic person, I'm a very creative person, and so on. But I have no space. I cannot use it. Because somebody says, no, I'm not going to hire you. Or the system, somehow, there's lots of unemployment, so I'm unemployed. So I don't know what else to do. I said, that's a thinking problem. It's not a problem that uh, it belongs to a human being. Uh, it, it is a system which is punishing a human being. In education, you're telling your young people, have a good grade, get to the good, best school, and get the best job. As if that is the end product of everything that we do. That is not. Human being is much bigger than that. So redirect them. We become entrepreneurs. So that can be an employment-free country. Because everybody has a chance, everybody can create their own thing, and it will be another country. The people of J.P. Morgan are of the highest caliber I've ever worked with. They are our firm's most valuable asset, and they are truly proud of what this firm represents and what they do every day.